save. <laughs> Amicia! Amicia, you won't believe it! Roderick beats Arthur at the sling! That's not true! He was in front of the line! <laughs> You're just rubbish! <laughs> oh, you two are arguing again. Ugh! If you don't play by the rules... You're gonna tell me... Hugo! ...about rules. I keep telling Have you. Have you seen Hugo? Hugo! Hey! Hugo! Where are you, Hugo! 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 Oh, no. He's... gone. It is done. Can I go and see my mother now? Only the Grand Inquisitor may say. But you told me. My words are of no importance. Only those of the Grand Inquisitor. But be sure, you are very precious to him indeed. been on Episangri's duty. People. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. The hour of the conjuration approaches. of the Grand Inquisitor is overwhelmed by the bite. I fear it will now attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the power's equilibrium. May his soul emerge unscathed. Ad Ad Lucam. Necessary to change the filters and scrape the tanks. Twenty pounds. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so, because that's all we'll be able to produce. Already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such quantities of Episangus. His faith protects him. It protects us all. Hey! Not afraid. Not afraid. Calling the city during the conjuration. You on the list? Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees us. And I'll be stuck here. We'll all meet again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party. Come on.
Eyes on me, like Melly. Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... Uh, if I may. It's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Hun. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Proceed. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. Your Inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era commands. Where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. He is with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice Doreen has regained consciousness. Fight the plague. Only our methods differ. 
Her daughter is making the same. Her daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Stupid. Attention! But the brother, he is unique. He might understand. Unique. I'm unique. At ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? Yes. The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. Congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? Captain, uh, I was told that the carrier of the Maxima is here. Is that right? The child turned himself in this morning. Apparently there was a disagreement. As I was telling you, this guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. It's just a matter of time. So let us pray that Vitalis' conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy without him. What was that? Never mind. Huh? More shadows. Uh, tell me. Why Don't can't I hear you like the others? Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a, a radical change of diet. <sighs> Good. Hey, kid. <gasps> Help me. No. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, no. die quietly. I'm trying to work here. I'd rather he waited a few while. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you! You'll all go to hell! You, you and your fucking rats! Save us, this respite. He's going to get mommy. Death is not an end. 
for your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children, your bride. It's horrible. Her son with a knife to his throat. She'll cooperate. So, Lord Nicholas, go past. That the rune woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. <laughs> Serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, no. She's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. She must be near. He can't get out. Ah, uh, please. At least let me die out there. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here, your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. Oh, that's that. For the last time, will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you're still upset about what happened to your husband. Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. 